Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix error. That is sign in error, error encountered while signing into Xbox Lite. So if you are receiving this error message whenever you try to launch Hello the Master Chief Collection game on your computer, then please follow the steps shown in this video. Now the first step is to go ahead and delete XBL device key from credential manager. So go ahead and type in credential manager in Windows search box and then click on credential manager. Now go to the Windows credentials, scroll down. Now at the end you will find this Xbox Live device key entry over here. So go ahead and click on remove, then click on yes. Now go ahead and try to launch the game once again. That should go ahead and fix the error message. This has worked for many users, so it might work for you. The next step is to go to this location. So open file explorer on your computer, then go to this PC, open C drive, then open users folder. Now open username folder and then open app data folder. If you don't see app data over here, on the top here you can see the view option, click on view and then put a check on the box which says hidden items and then you should be able to see app data. So open this app data, then open local low folder and over here you can see MCC folder. You have to go ahead and delete it. Now before you delete it, you can just make a right click then click on copy and you can just create a backup on the desktop. I'll keep it over here and then I, I'll go ahead and delete this and then you can go ahead and try to launch the game. Now you can also launch the game with mods and anti-cheat disabled for this go to steam make a right click on play and then put a check on the box which says play hello MCC anti-cheat disabled mods. So click on play over here. Now still you are facing the problem in that case you can go to this location so you have to open a registry editor so go ahead and type in registry editor in windows search box and then click on registry editor click on yes to allow and expand h key current user then expand software now expand microsoft now scroll down and over here you can see xbox live click on xbox live do not expand it just click on it and here you can see has fired sign in event so you have to go ahead and delete it now before you go ahead and delete you can go ahead and create a backup to create a registry backup just go to file then click on export select the location where you want to save the backup name it as backup or whatever name you want to give and for export range select all and then click on save and it will take a few seconds or maybe a minute to create a backup. Now once the backup is created in future whenever you want to go ahead and restore registry in that case go to file and then click on import you can go ahead and select the backup file and then click on open this will go ahead and restore the registry. Now once you click on xbox live over here you go ahead and select has fired sign in event make a right click then click on delete. Now once this is deleted go ahead and Go to the start menu, click on the power icon and then click on restart and after the system restart, once you restart the computer, you can go ahead and open Steam and then try to launch the game once again and that should go ahead and fix the error message. Now the next step is to allow the game exe file to your antivirus program. So if you have any third party antivirus, just make sure that you allow the game to uh, game exe file to your antivirus program. Also allow the game exe file to your firewall, Windows firewall. Now the next step is to run the game as an administrator for this go to steam make a right click on the game select manage then click on browse local files it will straight away take you to the game installation folder make a right click on the game exe file select properties go to the compatibility tab and then put a check on the box which says run this program as an administrator then click on apply ok and then try to launch the game. Now still you are receiving the error message in that case you can go ahead and verify the game files for this. Go to Steam, make a right click on the game, select properties and then go to the local files tab then click on verify integrity of game files and after the verification you can go ahead and try to launch the game. So one of the steps should definitely help you to get rid of this error. So that will be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.